Hi friends, welcome to Uti Knitting. Today I am going to show you how to knit this beautiful table mat. This is uh, very easy to make. Um, you can see the only thing is when you are making you just choose both the uh, same type of yarn. But minus this one is different and this, this uh, green and yellow is same but uh, this white is different. I found a bit difficult but while you making just go for a um, same type of yarn it's much better to go for a little bit thinner yarn um, that's you will found easy to make and this is the pattern I attach this uh, I'm going to attach this flower extra so this is the pattern this is how it looks like then center you can attach the flower like this and see it's the back side it looks like this hope you will enjoy this tutorial very easy to make uh, try to make this one before you go to the video don't forget to subscribe my channel like and share hope you will enjoy this video let's begin the tutorial so the first color i'm going to use is white and I'm going to use 2.5 millimeter hook. So let's begin. Make a slip knot and you have to make a chain 6. So 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6. And then make a slip stitch into the very first chain like this. And just make chain 1 and just pull like this and then you have to make 3 times here 1, 2 and 3. So after 3 just hold see this is my middle finger just hold this one like this and grab and insert your hook like this the second you have to the yarn you hold insert your hook there and make like this and then single crochet like that okay and then chain two one two and then again make same as that one two three and then just hold this one like this okay and then insert here and make single crochet so this is two times and then now make chain two one two again here one two just hold here three like this and then hold this one like this and like this and insert your hook here and then like that and then again chain two one two again see one two and three after that hold this one like this and insert your hook here and like that and chain three chain two so you have to make same as this see one two three four so you have to make this one four more times again so total eight times you have to make like this so here total i made eight times one two three four five six seven eight and i made chain two and you have to slip stitch top of here just slip stitch like this and you, we are going to work middle of in between this two so here we have to make single crochet like this so 
so like this so we have to make three times again so one two and three and then hold this one like this and then like this and chain two again one more time we are going to make here so one two three take everything out and then so two times again chain two again we have we are going to make here two times one two three and then so again one more one two again one two three here again two times one two and again you have to make here two times so one two three and again chain two one two and again here one two three take it out everything and then like this just continue work same as this two two end of here so here i completed so then make chain two one two and top of here make a slip stitch chain one and we are going to cut this one so and the next color i'm going to use this one so just make a slip knot and then you can attach this any way you want in between so let's start with here okay like this and make chain one and then one two and three and then again this side not the same place the next gap next chain two gap make three one two and three then yarn over and pull through all the loops and then like this and then again chain two one two and here the same gap here one here one okay so one two three and the next one here so one two and three and then yarn over pull through all the loops like this and then here like that again chain two and then here one here one okay so one two three okay that is one set and the next one here one two three okay and then you know we we'll pull through all the loops
okay then again chain two here one two three and then here so one two three and you know we'll pull through all loops and this one like this and then chain two again here one here one so one two three and then here one two three and then yarn over pull through all the loops and here and like that continue same as this end of the row so see this is almost we complete this row so make chain two and then here one here one okay so one two three and then again here one two three okay and then yarn over pull through all the loops and then here okay and then make chain two and here just slip stitch like this so this row is completed just make chain one and then cut this yarn so the next row we are going to use again the white so this row we are not going to work on chain two space we are going to work here see this is chain two space we are not going to work here we are going to work here okay so one two three okay same as uh, previous rows and then you have to make six chain one two three four five six and then again here see here you have to make double crochet like this see and then you have to make again one more here so one two three okay and then as usual okay like this and make chain two one two and we are going to work top of here just leave this chain two gap here make one two three one two and three and then we are going to work again like this chain six one two three four five six and again double crochet here And then again here, same as one, two, and three. Yarn over, pull through all. And 
like this and then again chain two one two and again here one two three we are not working on the chain two gap See, we are not working on the chain 2 gap. We are working top of here. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6. And then double crochet. Top of here. Like this. And again. 1, 2, 3, See? just continue work same as this end of the row so here we are going to complete this row make chain 2 and then top of here just slip stitch chain 1 and then we are going to cut this yarn and then the next color so it looks like this so the next color i'm going to use this one so just make a slip knot and then here the chain 2 we made here we are going to make single crochet see just make single crochet like this and then we are going to work here okay so here double crochet <coughs> seven times one Two, three, four, five, six, seven. You can make uh, this one as much you want. Depends upon your um, uh, yarn thickness. Even you can make nine or uh, seven. So, and then, see, I made 2, 4, 6, 1, 7. And I'm going to make chain 4, 2, 3, 4. And then, down these two loops here, insert your hook here. And then, make just slip stitch like this. And then, again, 7 double crochet. 1, 2, three four five six and seven okay and then single crochet into the chain two space here like this and then again seven double crochet one two three four five six and seven okay after seven double crochet make chain four one two three four and then you can see down this two loops here insert your hook there make a slip stitch like this and then again seven double crochet one two three four five 
6 and 7. If your yarn is very thin, you can make even 9 double crochets. See? And then again, single crochet here. And then again, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7. And then chain 4. 1, 2, 3, 4. Okay. And then here. Insert your hook here, slip stitch, again 7 more double crochet. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6 and 7. Okay, just continue work same as this end of the row. So, this is how it looks. See, have to work same as this end of the row. So, here I have completed this row. So, here I made slip stitch. So, this one I am going to cut this yarn so this is how it looks and then the next row again I'm going to use this green so let's make a slip knot and then we are going to work see here back side like this we are going to work back side just just this one just fold this one and work here see this chain to space we are working so just fold this one and then here single crochet just make like this so one two three okay this is same as before we are working and then make one two three you have to make chain three here not chain two okay and then we are going to work here so fold this one like this if you fold you can see two loops like this in between this two loops we are going to work see middle of this two loops put your needle insert your needle middle of this two loops and work one two and three next again make chain three one two three and then now here fold this one and here one two three and again three one two three now here see you can see two loops insert in between the two loops and one two three again chain three and then next here one two three and 
and then again three one two three and then next in between these two loops see back side when you fold you can see here insert your hook in between these two loops and one two and three so just continue work same as this just continue work same as this end of the row so we are going to complete this row same just made a chain 3 and then slip stitch here and chain 1 and cut this yarn okay and the next color we are going to use again white so make a slip knot here we are going to follow this um, green row this is the same pattern we are going to follow the next row see look at here so here the chain three space here just single crochet chain one see so we are going to make three times one two and three okay and then here we are going to make only chain two one two not chain three okay and then next next we are going to make next we are going to make oh sorry i did a mistake not like this so one two three and then here okay one two three and i will pull through all the loops and this one like this and then we are going to make <clears throat> only chain two not chain three one two and then again here one here one okay so one two three okay and then here one two and three okay so yarn over and pull through all the loops And then just chain two one two and then again one two three this is one the next one we are going to make here so one two and three okay and then yana will pull through all the loops and chain two again one two three and again the side one two three and then yarn over pull through all the loops 
and then one two just continue work same as this end of this row so next you will make here one here one then here one here one like that just continue work same as this so we have completed this row so the next row slip stitch here chain one the next row we are going to make here two puff stitch one two three and then make chain two one two and then one more puff stitch on the same stitch okay so one two three and then we are not going to work here we are going to work top of this two puff stitch so don't make chain two here just here make one two three okay this is first puff stitch and make chain two okay and again one more puff stitch here one two three okay so like this two two and then again here one two three this is our first proof stitch and then one two chain two and again one more proof stitch here two three okay in between here don't make chain two just work same as this end of this row so this row is completed the next row we are going to follow same as the previous row so slip stitch then chain one we are going to make same as this exactly same so one two three one puff stitch and then two again one more one two three okay and then again here one two three don't make chain two one two three so after this you have to make chain two and in between this one more puff one two three okay so continue same as this one two three chain two and one more one two three okay so in between here don't make chain two just here just here make chain two here don't make chain two so continue same as this end of the row we are going to complete this row also so here same as this you have to continue for few more rows see now we did three rows 
so this uh, same as the previous row this row we have to continue for um, few more rows see same as this Continue one, two, and same as same here. One, two, three, and in between here, don't make chain two. See, just make here one, two. Three, one, two, and then again one more, one, two, three, so continue same as this for, um, few more rows once i complete i will show you how to do the next one so i totally knit the white one two three four five five rows so here i'm going to cut this yarn and i'm going to join this one so here we are going to work same as this so the next color i'm going to join this one so we are going to work same as the previous row but there are small different so we are going to work in between here same as previous row So, one, two, three, okay, and then chain two, and same place, one more poof, one, two, three, okay, and then here, we are going to make two one two okay and then here so one two three and then chain two again one more one two three and again chain two one okay and then again here one two and three and chain two one two and again one more one two three and again chain two one and here one one two three and chain two again one two three again chain two and here one two three continue work same as this the only different is in between you will have you will have a uh, two two double crochets okay that's the only different 
okay continue work this one end of end of this row so here this row we are going to complete one two and i'm going to make slip stitch here and cut this yarn next we are going to use again our white color so we can start from here same we are going to work in between this uh, In between the stoop of stitch make chain one we can make first puff one two and three okay and then what we are going to do is we are going to make chain six one two three four five and six and then double crochet here like this okay then we are going to make one more puff here so one two three okay and then chain two one two okay so next we have to work here so one two and three okay and then chain six one two three four five six and then like this and just here one more double crochet okay and then again one more puff one two three and then chain two in between don't forget to make chain two so next puff two three okay and then chain six and then double crochet here and again one more puff one two three and then chain two continue work same as this end of the row so next row we will make here this one okay so we are going to complete this row cut this yarn so next row we are going to use again this color so make a slip knot we are going to work same as this so here just make a single crochet okay like this and then here we are going to make same as this seven double crochet so one two three four five six and seven next make chain four one two 
three, four, and then down these two loops, make a slip stitch like this, and then again seven double crochet. So one, two, three, four, five, six, and seven. Okay, and then again we are going to make here single crochet, and then again seven double crochet. So one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, and then chain four. One, two, three, four, and then down these two loops, make a slip stitch like this. And then again seven double crochet. One, two, three, four, five, six, and seven. Okay, and then again here single crochet. And then again here seven double crochet one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, and then chain four one, two, three, four, and then down these two loops there just make slip stitch like this and then again seven double crochet one two three four five six and seven and then here single crochet that's it continue work same as this end of the row see this is same as this one just work same as this end up here so the end we are going to just slip stitch here and chain one and cut this yarn so the next row Next row we are going to use again this color. So the next row make a slip knot and then we are going to work here. This is same as this green we are going to work here. So here We are going to work one poof. So one, two, three. Okay. And then you have to make chain three. So one, two, three. And then in between here. So after chain three, see you can see here in between these two loops, we are going to make one more. One, two, three. Okay. And then again make chain three, not chain two, chain three. One, two, three. And then again fold this one here. One, two, three. Again make chain three. One, two, three. And then again in between this 
two loops here one two three okay and then again chain three and then fold this one here one two three okay and then again three one two three and then here again in between here yep in between here make here because this is our starting point that's why so here one two and three okay don't forget to hide this all this yarn and then chain three one two three and then again here one two three okay just continue work same as this end of this row so you will have like this so now we are going to finish this one just make chain three one two three and make a slip stitch here and you can finish it off if you want this one you can make even more bigger you can make more bigger like uh, you can knit few more rows you can make a few more rows then uh, knit same as this here start starting with this row starting with this row you can same continue here and then you, you can make it bigger as much you want so i'm going to stop from here i'm not going to make more bigger and that's up to you you can make how much bigger you want and this is the flower you can put the flower on center like this hope you will like this video see the back side is looks like this you can hide all this yarn okay so this is the front side so you can fix this flower as well thank you for watching